So I will start from uh, blank VI. Okay. <laughs> so this is my new VI and uh, the first thing I'll need a uh, CSV file in lab view can contain three basic parts. Uh, so first uh, maybe header and second part may be the channel names and thirds may be measurement data. A CSV file contains three basic things. So, uh, in order to write headers, I'll go just file input output and write a delimited display seat. Okay. I have to set address for keeping this file. So, I'll make it control. Okay. Uh, then, in order to have header, I just need a table like this. This is header. We can select number of rows and column according to our use. Uh, I don't need this scroll bar, so I will remove this. And uh, I need three columns and two rows. So this is it. And in first uh, box, I will put uh, measurement. And second, instrument and third uh, maybe date or anything as you want for measurement I, I will write x for instrument I will write y and for date I will write just z anything I can fill in these boxes uh, and then I have to connect this header to this delimited spread seal VI. Uh, I need one more thing delimited to separate these uh, boxes. I need comma. So this is comma or underscore anything you can put here so we have completed for a uh, header part i can select uh, this frame for decoration i will just need a frame uh, this could be i, I will copy this frame from here and paste it here. Uh, I can make it colorful like uh, green or something. Okay, mm, maybe yellow. And then I can also make more decoration. Like, I will just copy. This header. Mm -hmm. 
Velo. Okay, so I'm done this header part, and second, I have to write channel names. So in order to do that, uh, I just place another table. Mm -hmm. Again, I don't need this scroll bars, so I will just remove these vertical and horizontal scroll bars. And just need a single column for writing channel names. This may be channel one. Channel two. Channel three. channel 4 and so on I can write any number of channels here channel 5 okay. this is channels Again, I have to take a delimited spreadsheet VI and connect these channels to this VI. And this time I have to transpose it because I have taken just a column. I just want to make it row. So I will transpose this. Just add this file into here and yes, delimiter. I have to put as comma underscore anything. So again, I am done with uh, this channel link. I can decorate this. And then I need uh, this measurement data. Uh, so uh, I can generate some data, some random data. Uh, so for this, I need a for loop. And in for loop, I will place a random number generator. And this number of uh, index, the index of for loop will be equal to number of channels. So I have created five channels. So I have to put five here. And uh, then I'll need another is delimited spreadsheet. And connect this random generator random number generated to this spreadsheet okay I can put this thing inside a while loop and a number of measurements or we can just Thank mm -hmm. you. 
this. और नॉट दिस वे जस्ट आई विल कनेक्ट दिस टू दिस एंड स्टॉप टू दिस सो दिस इज द मेजरमेंट डेटा व्हिच वी वांट टू रिसीव इन सीएसपी फाइल सो आई थिंक आई एम डन I have to set location where I want to save data. So this is Let us run this program. Uh I have to fill the number of measurements so so for the number of measurement I will put 20 it means we i want to record 20 readings so this loop will run uh, 20 times it is running meanwhile i can also stop this measurement so let us stop this so let us check uh, do we have we saved data or not so this is data new csv test so you can see we have saved data in this manner uh, we have identified different channels by comma and different readings by space so in this way you can save data save your desired data in in this csv file thanks for watching